Hello viewers, you're watching Underpowered Nation Part 11. Uh, <clears throat> let's just continue. Um, actually, no, before we continue, let's check the cities. You should do this regularly, because sometimes, like here, well, this is just okay, but sometimes the governor just assigns uh, your citizen to... Uh, to a place where you don't want them to be. Um, in this one, we're building a windmill. Uh, what I'll do? I'll switch to work boat for for a second, for three turns, and then we'll go back to windmill because we got this fish tile, and this city is growing too slow according to my taste. Um, you should what you're doing you are yeah this is all okay this one that's good actually yep so this one is doing good and this one is production focused for now because it's already it already has 10 citizens and we're building a university this is also good Let's go next turn, see what happens. In this part we should... Uh, okay. Um, in this part we should explore the world, we should find other... Not just the civilization, not just the leaders, but also their empires. I, I thought that this is connected here because I saw um, a Chinese uh, unit here, but it looks like this is really an island and now... Yeah, I don't know. It's maybe it's China, but actually that's not necessarily true. It can be somebody else there, but we will see very very soon. Rio de Janeiro. You are you have dice. Maritime allied with Inca. This is a good candidate dice. Uh, yeah. And it would, uh, Rio de Janeiro would help us grow. Now, Venice is looking for assistant ag assistance against Inca. Uh, so. We could give some units to Venice. I don't know, maybe the influence um, goes up faster if you give them units when they actually request units. Because you can give them units anyway. Uh, and this um, giving units to city-states really has a re minor effect on your relations with them. And Sydney requests units. So Incans declared war on both two city-states. Wine and open borders with Chinese. Let's see. Wine and cotton. Good. And let's renew that deal. We cannot sign research agreements due to special rules and we cannot sell horses to them. These are the limitations of this special game. Um, now university here is finished. Um, you may... Yeah, we want to grow this city. Um, market, no. Harbor, no. Windmill, stable. Let's build a windmill, because now we will need to take some... Yeah, production will suffer, because we will pick... Mm. We will pick citizens from the hill first, because they need to grow. And we will put them into the university. Um, now, this one is now... Let's see, we use city, okay, this farm should become a training post. 
continue here. Stockholm also has dice. And they are irrational city-state. Oh yes, I see the Chinese border, so... Okay, you should go and build the tiles around Antium. Stockholm, incense, wine... Okay, we did all that. Next turn... Okay, we discovered Inca and <laughs> China is now the ally of Hanoi, okay, Shanghai, mm, now let's see where you can go to do something useful for us, I think you should put You should go there and build a trading post. You should go this way and build a trading post there. Okay, now we have this workboat ready. Uh, let's see where we want to go south. Inca, Incan territory, Kathmandu. Where is Kathmandu? Ah, there is their 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 Carol. Hostile. No, we don't need that. Great Barrier Reef. <laughs> we really don't have any problems with happiness now. So, let's just build all the units, uh, all the buildings that are missing here. What is the most important? Maybe we should go garden. No, workshops. So, because this will unlock the um, how is it called uh, that special national wonder I don't know I forgot but um, yep we have bank now let's go um oh we can build Oxford University now and we will get one free technology. Sure, I think that's what we need now. Uh but let's think about it. This will be in ten turns. In ten turns let's prepare so that we can open one really important technology. In ten turns mm, would be good if we could open steam power so maybe we will uh, f before that so yeah we will build the 10 turns and then we will wait one we will put something else into the production for one turn and then we will finish it so that we can open steam power which is much more much stronger technology than military science for example Uh, wait, maybe I remember that. I think we should go fertilizer after scientific. I think we should rethink that. We should to go. Um, yeah, I think we should go scientific theory because I think production is not the big issue now. We should go scientific theory then fertilizer we have so much happiness so I think that uh, being able to grow is more important so that leaves us that's 18 turns before steam power uh, and we don't have uh, we don't have to build at Oxford University just yet we can build lighthouse and harbor uh, before before we build uh, Oxford University 
continue with the windmill and now we can we will do this and when we will uh, upgrade the fishes um, we will get more a shorter expansion time for the s um, for the population Kathmandu next turn okay let's continue here let's see now okay that's now 11 turns until a new citizen is born uh, something happened here this is not what I like uh, this is probably okay it went away this game has problems with graphics sometimes the map is just it's not updated on the screen uh, now what to do with you um, I should go back onto this road Athens finished the garden um, yeah we have people specialists in the university uh, windmill would be nice but I don't think we need to grow that bad now aqueduct let's build a bank it will take 25 turns to grow here okay we are still firmly allied with these city-states we are happy we are actually very happy mm, I could ally Rio de Janeiro but I don't think there is a real need to do that just yet okay so everybody's happy so so much happiness in this game the game looks very peaceful at the moment. Every great advance in science okay, now we have scientific theory. Okay, so let's call Darius. Mm. Ah, they don't, they don't have money for research agreement. But never mind, we can exchange gold for gold per turn. Research agreement is 250, so they would need roughly uh 170 i guess 170 i give you 170 and you give me five gold per turn all right and now we sign a research agreement and i can also sell you some horses no iron or one gold per turn and six gold okay everybody's happy now ah we discovered some iron oh perfect seven coal right there like i would knew <laughs> i really wanted to uh, uh turn the jungle into a trading post but now we will build a mine um farm okay let's see what is down there Geneva friendly cultured city-state let's see what do they have they have gold okay Now we're going through fertilizer. Actually now, since the research agreement helped us 
think we should immediately now the the things now um, okay let's, let's see if there's another research agreement coming very soon okay this one is still far away I know there's not a research agreement this one is still far away and yeah so uh, so we should uh, cancel that harbor and we should go to Oxford University which takes 11 turns and steam power will be enabled will be available by then so let's do this and we continue okay Krakatoa even more happiness iron okay I'm just checking the cities because usually like here things change then you have to know to react okay do it let's do it like this next turn so sorry sorry we have a research agreement with Darius and that's really not something we want we don't want to go to war with them now Okay, I think we have open borders with China. Yes, so we can go this way Just to see what's happening In there, okay, ooh seven coal right there Let's oh, we're getting this in four turns. Okay, let's not waste time then I wanted to buy that tile, but uh, since it will be included into our empire very soon, there's really no need for doing that. Um, you should build more mines. Um, I will put a, an academy there, so I will not do anything. Okay, let's start here. I think I can reach, yes, from Antium or not. One, two, three, yes. So build uh, plus two food or plus two gold. Build a trading post. Um, we are fr still friends with old friends. <laughs> and we have we have a research agreement with you. Every now and then you have to check all the all the other AIs because um, things change, you know. Maybe they acquire new luxury stores that you would like to buy, or or sometimes you forget forget to renew the research agreement. At least that's what I do. So why I'm regularly checking this. Um, okay, let's continue. Next turn. Aha, so Darius will be isolated probably very soon. Um, but uh, you know, I will play dumb now and of course I will not declare war on Darius now. We have a research agreement going. But after that's done we can denounce them, get some influence from the other civilizations, uh, friendly influence that is. Almaty is neutral, allied with Persia. And they have dies. Okay. <laughs> Quebec City. I think we. I already met them. Quebec City is maritime. City state. Thirteen happiness. I don't know where where this happiness is coming from, but ah, uh, you know what we should do. S we have. We should purchase a public school here 
Um, and of course, give. Uh, give somebody into the public school uh, now we can build public school and it will be built much faster in London London is still production focused which is okay ah I think we forgot we should put specialists into university let's do this And this now we are stagnating. Uh wait, wait, something went wrong, so let's do this and this okay now we are starving, that's not good. We definitely need these two whales. Okay, at least we are stagnating now. So we should we should uh, convert these two uh, trading posts into farms. Um, all right. Okay, we are still allied with city states, so we can continue next turn. Now we have fertilizer. Now we will grow much faster, even. Okay, so Incas and Chinese are neighbors. Uh, hoo -hoo, Gandhi is bringing a large army here. But farm. Maybe we shouldn't uh, sell open borders to Gandhi anymore. Mm, public school here is quite expensive. Uh, we should go public school, but yeah, we should select more hill tiles, 19 turns. Fourteen turns. Okay, fourteen turns is okay, I guess. Um, okay, we need to renew friendship with Incans. Ah, uh, that's okay. They are happy to accept. Everybody is so happy in this game. I don't understand it. Usually, when you play on hard difficulties, they're all the time they're fighting. It looks like they are fighting with you, but in this game, it looks like they are fighting among themselves and they are leaving me alone. Uh, I guess I was happy here. If I start buying city states, I'm afraid they will change their m uh, mood. Especially here, I would like to buy this one. Okay, let's do it. Now we are allies with Rio de Janeiro. Next turn. <laughs> it looks like that. <laughs> England and India will have a huge war here. Um, yeah, I think that now Gandhi is better prepared than previous time. At least they have some meat shields. Let's continue around this continent mm. 
Six turns. I think we won that. So in six turns, maybe even one turn sooner. Uh, but we would need more. S still six turns. Five turns. Yeah, we get military science in five turns and we get Oxford University in five turns. Next turn. Okay, we should go there. Uh, bank is out. Now we should build public school here. Yeah, I think this is okay. Next turn. Okay, the, a lot of things happened. It looks like that, yeah, Gandhi declared on Darius. Ger Gandhi is a warmonger in our game. Constantly declaring war on neighbors. Uh, okay, Brussels. Uh, Alright. Uh, now, where do you want to go? Let's go here. Huh. And up. Mm, okay. Build more lumber mills. Brussels. Okay, they're friendly. Ah, oh, we need more production. We cannot make this Oxford University in two turns. Never mind. Okay, we st we rediscovered more ruins. It's very late in the game for ruins. Um, Mumbai... Okay. Where's the capital? Usually it's... Mumbai is... Probably the second city that they built. So Delhi is probably somewhere here. Yeah, India is a good candidate for our next expansion. Alright, we are still growing. Next turn. Wars may be fought with weapons. Okay, now we have military science. Let's check here. Uh alright. Connect more coal. Now we have one turn of research and we should put this somewhere else. We could go put this one turn into archaeology. Uh, finally, this one has grown now. Next turn.
Okay, now we have this and we can open steam power and we are in the industrial era. Perfect. Um, Antium built a windmill. We should go immediately to public school. This will take 12 turns. Okay, build me more, more farms, you should continue this way, let's see London is stagnating, mm. okay that's better. Uh, Mine, choose production. Uh, now iron works here. Let's build iron. I mean, I'm not um, or fact. Ah, uh, for factory we need coal. And yeah, so let's build a harbor, and then we will get coal half. This we will get in two turns, yeah, and then we can build a factory, and we can buy a factory in Rome, we have money. Lhasa is still our ally, Venice, Warsaw, and this one here. Where is the, the four city-states? Rio de Janeiro, perfect. And we're getting dice from them. Okay, we're still growing very nice. Uh, before we go into the next turn, I will stop recording this part here. Um, I think, yeah, we are doing a very good job. Um, we're climbing up in the scoreboard. Uh, we will, uh, we still need, uh, so Incans and Chinese are still ahead of us. Now we know a little bit uh, how the world looks like. We know where are the opponents. Uh, India is here on this continent. It's the closest. Uh, it's the closest neighbor that still has their capital. Uh, let's see. Do they have their capital? Victory progress. Yes, India still has the capital. It's only our neighbors and the Iroquois who lost their capital. And um, Darius is here. Mm. Yeah, they have quite small empire. Uh, we still don't know very much about the Incans, we have to uncover that, but Incans are direct neighbors of... Mm, yeah, this is still covered with fog. Are direct neighbors of Chinese, which explains why they are at war all the time. So we have to explore this as well. And then the question will be whom to attack first. So um, if you're watching this and if you have some comments, some ideas, let me know what you would do in this situation. Um, what we I would do is I would I would still uh, try to research, try to research the world, try to uncover all this fog. And um, I don't know somehow I think that uh, Darius will be. Let's check the relations. Yeah, a lot of mm, yeah, yeah yeah a lot of uh, people denounced uh, Persia. So I would wait until our uh, research, uh, let's see, uh, diplomacy, um, research agreement runs out in uh, 237, so I would prepare so that in, uh, in, in 15 turns I would prepare to be ready. Uh, for that I would need um, at least uh, I would need open borders with Gandhi and I would need at least um, artillery which is quite close here artillery and rifles and I would attack Darius Darius is not that high on the on the on the scoreboard so I think it's doable the question is then I would I would be left with uh, with an empire with uh, India in between which is not optimal because I will not be able to connect the cities so the other way would be 
just to forget this politics and just declare whoever is the closest one that's India in our case uh, uh, declare war on India take them out and then finish with Darius that's an alternative and of course there are there are two other cities uh, two other civilizations India and and Inca which are much farther away so we have to think and analyze that's all in this part viewers I hope you're enjoying it let me know what you think about it see you in the next one and bye bye